Hello everyone, it's Squeakerwood HCG coming to you. I'm at a roadblock. <laughs> um, I'm headed home, so I'm really glad about that. Oh man, I have to tell you. Yesterday, I wanted to eat all day. All day. Not just a little bit. I wanted to eat everything. They had malts and they had all sorts of stuff all day my mom made this chicken salad with grapes and um, pecans and oh my gosh it was just crazy so <clears throat> I made me uh, extra vegetable I did not cheat I'm gonna tell you what yesterday probably was the closest that I've ever come as, as long as I've been doing the HCG for 51 days I believe it's the only day that I wanted to really cheat, but I didn't. So I went in the kitchen, I got my coconut spray, and I got my asparagus, and I put it in a pan, and I almost charred it. I mean, it was it was crispy, not burned, but oh my goodness, my dad came in there and he said, what are you eating? I said, french fries, yummy. So... We were pretty stir crazy yesterday though because my dad wasn't feeling good so we just had to sit around the house all day and that was not fun so anyway um, I wanted to tell you a couple of days ago we went to uh, my mom and I went to this little clothing store and I ha and first I'll say <coughs> let me tell you about my weight I stepped on the scales today and it was the same as yesterday. I had a goose egg, zero, zero. But um, uh, is it Je uh, Jean? Jeannie uh, made a comment the other day, and she said I should go play the lottery because yesterday my weight was 177.7. So she said, with all these sevens, you better do something. So. Uh, today, I also had a 177.7, so if there's a 777 ticket, I should buy it. I have, uh, so, I everybody, everybody knows in my life that things happen to me all the time that are just the most amazing, awesome things you've ever, ever experienced. The other day, when Mom and I went to this clothing store, and I like burnout shirts, and I wear them with my Harley shirts because, like, you have a lot of tank tops. Isn't this the cutest? It's bling, ye bling. -y. So I wear them under my tank tops so I can wear them whenever it's cooler, too. And so um, we went in this store and I bought a couple. I bought a mint color, I bought all these different kinds. And then I found this oh my goodness, I love pink and black. And I found this shirt that's pink and black. and kind of sheer with hot pink around the collar so cute so I'm gonna have to yell because we're starting to go now so anyway I get this shirt and I go up to pay for everything my mom's still looking around and the shirt is um, I'm sorry I go up to pay and we're gonna just say it was a hundred dollars I think it was a hundred I think it was actually ninety dollars and whenever I went up to pay she said, oh, I'll give you 20%. I said, oh, cool, that's nice. So, it's, I pay 70 or $80. We'll say 75 And so, my mom's still looking. And I'm looking around, and I found this jacket. Oh, my goodness. It's a military jacket. But it has ruffles around the top and down the front. And then it's kind of got brushed nickel looking buttons down each side so so cute so I said oh my goodness the girl comes up and says can I help you and I said I want that jacket and she said you know what I'll give you 10% off if you want it and I said you know what this is what I'd rather do I'd rather return everything I just bought and get the jacket and then get 20% off of all of it she kind of laughed and she said okay I said well if you can't do it that's fine but I'll just return it <coughs> I've still got this stuff so 
I return all of it and get the jacket. So she's doing her little scanny thing, scan, 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 and then she adds it back up and she puts the jacket on it. So it should cost about a hundred or hundred fifty to hundred sixty dollars before she gives me my twenty percent off. And I said, uh, I said I was just talking to her. I said that's really nice of you to do that, and I appreciate it. And blah blah blah. She's no problem. So she finishes, and the total she says. $46 and I said what she said it's $46 and I said how is it $46 I said I just paid 80 70 80 and I, I said there's no way in the jacket 60 she said it's right it's right I said, um, okay and I said uh, well I appreciate it and I said are you sure she said, it's right. I said, okay, I'm out of here. So when mom finished, I mean, hers, she didn't get anything on sale. And whenever she finished, we got in the car. And I told her what happened. And she said, how does that happen to you? She, and my dad says, you can walk into a store and they will just hand you stuff. <laughs> I said, I don't know. I don't know. I just thought it was so funny. And so, about a week or so ago, I and I think I mentioned this in one of my vlogs, I bought a bunch of, I bought three pair of jeans in a size 14. And the old ones I was wearing, I, I wore men's pants because I don't like the stretchy stuff. But I, I was wearing a size 40 in men's. So, I went in this store, whenever I went to Dillard's, and this woman was like, girlfriend, you need some new pants. <laughs> So thank you. So anyway, I bought three pair of size 14. And then, so day before yesterday, I was going to return two pair because they're getting too big. And I have, I've only won one. And so I went in and this girl said, don't return them today. And I said, okay. She said, return them tomorrow. I said, okay. So I left, and yesterday when I wanted to eat the television because of the commercials and the, oh my gosh, it was horrible. But so we were just around the house all day with their, and, and we had to go get my dad a malt and cheese sticks and blah, 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 blah. So I told my mom, I said, when we go get this stuff, I need to run into Dillard's and exchange these pants because I want to get some 12s. And uh, this girl, it was a different woman there. So I walk in, and I said, I want to exchange these two pair of pants, and I want to get uh, some 12s. And she said, okay. And I thought, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to get two 12s, and I'm going to get two 14s. No, no, two 10s. Maybe I'm being crazy, but I just know they're going to fit. So she rings it up. And she rings up the next two. So I get, I exchange two and I get four. And she says, um, well, I, uh, that's going to be $19. Huh. They're $70 pants. So I exchange two, I get four, and I pay $19. Isn't that just so crazy, crazy stuff? One time my friend and I went to a restaurant and she always paid. Have you ever been with somebody that always wanted to pay? And I told her, I said, you know what? You're not paying. Well, we ordered. I mean, she ordered a steak and shrimp and an appetizer and all this stuff. She's this big. So we get our we get our food and and she says uh, bring me the ticket and I said oh no 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 I'm gonna get it today and she said no I'm gonna get it I mean we nearly had a fight in the in the in the restaurant so I said you know what you're not gonna get it she's fine fine so I she and I'm fixing to pay and she goes to the restroom. When she's in the restroom, the lady comes back to the table and she says, 
she hands me the ticket she says how much time do you have and I mean the ticket is like seventy dollars <coughs> and I said what do you mean and she said how much time do you have and I said well you know we can't be here all afternoon so she comes back she leaves she comes back to the table and she says well guess what I said what she said the computers are down and I said really and she said they are and she said there's nothing I can do and she said you know what I'm just gonna we're just gonna give it to you don't worry about me before so it's so funny because it happens all the time and uh, I always tell all my friends of course I'm playing okay I tell all my friends it's just because I'm God's favorite he carries an 11 by 14 of me in his wallet just kidding. Just kidding. So anyway, I am headed home. Thank the Lord. We have two more weeks next week and the week after, and we are finished with chemo and radiation. Um, I'm not going to go home next weekend, so I'm going to try to enjoy my husband. He's working on the house. We have remodeling to do in every room. We Right now, we live in a shell, so... I'm excited about getting it done. We have new furniture, and it's in the furniture place storage. So I'm really excited about that. So I'll probably go home next weekend. I don't know. I'm hoping my motorcycle's ready this next weekend. I can ride my ride. Anyway, I've just chatted for 11 minutes on a bunch of baloney. I guess I will let you go, and I'm excited. I just wanted to say also that I'm so sorry I haven't responded to everyone's comments. I haven't even seen everyone's comments. But what I've seen have just been, oh my gosh. Y'all, you guys are wonderful. I just love you all so much. But I have used three gigabytes out of four in eight days blogging and using my phone to check everything and I can't respond to each individual thing on my phone so and his internet at the house that we're staying at is so slow I can type the letter faster than it takes I tried to upload the vid the vlog was it night before last and it kept going off and we get to the very end and it would go off so I turned I had his wi-fi on so I tried to do it through my phone and I've, I've used so much, so that's why I, I haven't responded to everybody. So, I guess I will go now, and uh, I love you guys, and I can't wait to watch the rest of your vlogs, and congratulations to Sugarbug, losing like 11 and a half pounds in two days. She lost 6.5 or whatever, unloading. Anyway. Love you guys. Talk to you later. Bye.